Hello students today in this lecture we are going to study introduction of pre stressed concrete Now question arises what is pre stressed concrete pre stressing is the intentional creation of permanent stress in a structure or assembly for improving its behavior and strength under various service conditions in ordinary reinforced concrete consisting of concrete and mild steel as basic components the compressive stresses are borne by concrete while tensile stresses are borne entirely by steel the concrete only acts as a binding material it does not take part in resisting the external forces in pre stressed concrete compression is induced prior to loading in the zone where external loads would normally cause tensile stresses in the case of long beam where large shear force exists the beam sizes have to be large to limit the diagonal tensile stresses under certain limits pre stress decreases diagonal tensile stresses this has led to adopt modified i section and t section in which there is substantial reduction in bab area in order to get the maximum advantage of a pre stressed concrete member it is necessary to use not only high strength concrete but also high tensile steel wires concrete used for pre stressed work should have cube strength of 35 newton per mm square for post tension system and 45 newton per mm square for pre tension system in the design of a pre stressed concrete member the estimated loss of pre stress due to shrinkage of concrete and creep of concrete and steel is at order of nearly 200 newton per mm square now example of pre stressed concrete structure in india the application of pre stressed concrete diversified over the years the first pre stressed concrete bridge was built in 1948 under the assam rail link project among bridges the pamban road bridge at rameshwaram tamil nadu remains a classic example of the use of pre stressed concrete girder this is the image you can see of pamban road bridge at rameshwaram tamil nadu now next is reinforced concrete concrete is strong in compression weak in tension this all you know steel is strong in tension reinforced concrete uses concrete to resist compression and to hold bars in position and uses steel to resist tension tensile strength of concrete is neglected and is taken as zero reinforced concrete beam allows crack under service load now from this diagram we can see for reinforced concrete beam on application of load beam will deflect in downward direction due to which tensile cracks takes place due to which tensile cracks takes place but in pre stressed concrete beam due to pre stressing beam will bend in upward direction and on application of vertical load it becomes straight so no tensile cracks developed in pre stressed concrete beam what is pre stressed concrete question arises it is a method of applying pre compression to control the stresses resulting due to external loads below the neutral axis of the beam pre compression resulting either no tension or compression pre stressed concrete is the one in which internal stresses are induced in a planned manner so that the stresses resulting from external loads are counteracted to a desired level or we can say pre stress means to induce compressive stress in the zones 
where external loads would normally cause tensile stress. Pre-stressed concrete is better as compared to RCC that is reinforced cement concrete because of two major causes. First, minute cracks observed in RCC can be eliminated. High tensile steel can be used economically. Now, these are the two figures you can see. In first figure, a concrete beam will begin to bend when heavily loaded by this loaded truck. Now, this concrete beam will produce crack at bottom since in bottom tensile force will be developed. Therefore, the base of the beam starts to crack where the concrete is pulled apart. In third diagram, you are seeing placing a steel rod inside the beam holds the concrete together and stops the beam from cracking. And in fourth diagram, you are seeing this is of pre-stress diagram and this is of RCC. In fourth diagram, is stretching the rod and then releasing it to squeeze the concrete makes the beam very strong. This will be very strong. It is of pre-stressed concrete and this is also strong but it will not produce crack and this is of RCC and this is both of a concrete cement. Now in this beam you are seeing load is applied from top due to which the deflected shape of beam will be like this load deflection downward and in third tendons stressed and in fourth pre-stress forces will be developed. Due to this pre-stress deflection will be upward and if load is coming from top that is heavy load is coming from top due to that the total deflection will be flat. This is the concept of pre-stressed concrete. Moving toward next the terminology are used in this our first tendon, a stressed element used in a concrete member of a structure to impart pre-stress to the concrete. Encourage, a device generally used to enable the tendon to impart and maintain pre-stress in concrete. Now, pre-tensioning, a method of pre-stressing concrete in which the tendons are tensioned before the concrete is placed. In this method, the concrete is introduced by the bond between steel and concrete. Post-tensioning, a method of pre-stressing concrete by tensioning the tendons against hardened concrete. In this method, the pre-stress is imparted to concrete by bearing. Thank you students.